You're watching EAC News. Thank you for joining us. The Secretary General of the International Organization for Francophonie, Louise Mushiki Vabo, informed Prime Minister Hun Sen that her purpose in bringing investors from 24 French speaking countries to Cambodia is to visit, explore, and seek investment with Cambodian investors. She also said that Cambodia is a model country among all French speaking countries. EAC News reporter Dashana Gojin has more. In a meeting with Prime Minister Hun Sen held on the morning of Tuesday, 29th March, at the Peace Palace in Phnom Penh, the Secretary General of the International Organization for Francophonie, Louise Mushikawabo, said that during her recent visit to Cambodia, investors from a number of French speaking countries signed a memorandum of understanding with Cambodian investors while assessing the economic situation and investment. The Prime Minister's assistant, Ieng Sopalek, told reporters after the meeting, the IOF Secretary General informed Prime Minister Hun Sen that the purpose of her and her delegation's visit to Cambodia is to foster cooperation in the field of investment and trade so that it can continue to grow and become lasting. Her visit now is the starting point for future cooperation. In response to the IOF Secretary General, Prime Minister Hun Sen praised the search for cooperation between investors from French-speaking countries to Cambodia and said, Economy, trade, and investment are at the heart of cooperation between Cambodia and the Francophone International Organization. Ying Sopalite quoted Prime Minister Hun Sen saying, Our country and our region have potential. We just do not have yet the opportunity. We should have to work together to seize the opportunities we have not only to strengthen and expand cooperation between the two countries, but also for the political relations between our two countries. Because good economic relations, trade, and investment will lead to political closeness. The IOF was founded on 20th March 1970 by former Senegalese President Leopold Sedar Senghor, Tunisian President Habib Bourjouiba, Nigerian President Hamani Diori, and King Norodom Sihanouk of Cambodia. The IOF promotes the French language and fosters political, educational, economic, and cultural cooperation among its 88 member countries, including Cambodia. Darshana Gauchin, EAC News.